Welcome back. I know we already talked about March Madness, but that's kind of what everyone's talking about, I think, right now. So let's keep it going. All four Oregon and Oregon State teams are in the tournament right now. So tonight we got kind of a, a vault inside of another vault. It's like a vault inception situation. This is a story that we did back in 2007 about the 1939 University of Oregon Webfoots men's basketball team who were the very first NCAA tournament winners. It was nearly 70 years ago and the Oregon Ducks made history winning the first ever NCAA basketball championship. Now the tournament has the juices flowing once again for 88 year old John Dick. It stirs up old memories if you but and it means a great deal to me because I'm very fond of this group of young men. I think nice. that they uh, are all excellent role models and we can all be proud of them. Dick, a retired admiral, is the last living member of the Tall Furs, who beat Ohio State 46-33. Dick was the leading scorer with 13 points. Oregon finished 29-5 and, and received a hero's welcome on their train ride back through Oregon. If you had to pick one thing that you took from that whole experience for the rest of your life, what was it? I'd have to say that we won the whole thing. In the state of Oregon until that time, there had not been a sports team who had won a national championship. In 1988, on the 50th anniversary of the Final Four, I interviewed head coach Hobby Hobson, who passed away in 1991. I'm very proud of some things about that team, by the way, Joe. The starting five were all native Oregonians. The players are bigger, stronger, faster, and more skilled now, but Dick says the ingredients of a winner are still the same. We didn't care who got the credit for it. We were, we were, all, we were interested in one thing, winning. I'd like to see a couple of wins from some of our teams in the tournament. That'd be fun, right? 